Hello, Miss A. So this is our market segmentation analysis. Do you mind taking a look at it for us? No problem. Oh, so I see you've outlined, outlined five main strategies living up to his name. Is that ethical being trying to be as ethical as possible? So one of their main strategy is to live up to his name by creating value through being socially responsible and giving back to the community. And so the, all their coffee are 100% fair trade certified, meaning that they follow strict environmental standards protecting the producers and the sellers as well. And also they support local and international initiatives such as Child Aid Project Somos by giving back to the community. So they're really, Ethical Being is really more about just making, more than just making profits, they're, about, they're more about giving back to the society and contributing to the community as well. And another big strategy that they are striving for is to appeal to the healthy lifestyle by going green and being environmentally friendly. All their coffee beans are organically certified and that all their facilities are carbon neutral and are built to really strict environmental standards as well. And they're really all about reducing, reusing and recycling in their company. That's impressive. Oh, I also see they are very technologically advanced. So recently they started using this new mobile technology called the QR code. Basically what it does is that on each bag of the coffee there's a code on there which consumers can scan with their smartphones. And through scanning they're able to see the story behind each of the bags. Um, like where it's made, where it's from, how it's made, etc. Nice. That's very impressive. I, however, don't understand your last point. Can you please elaborate? Mm -hmm. So, as I mentioned above, by using the QR code, they are being they are building on corporate transparency. They want all the consumers to be able to see the, each of the process of how the coffee was obtained and how it's being sold so that they are not hiding anything from the public eye. And also, since they're competing with coffee giants such as Starbucks, they really want to focus on building their brand and fostering loyalty and reputation. So by being local based, they're able to start from building that in Vancouver and slowly moving nationally outwards. So since the coffee industry is fairly saturated already, they want to make sure that they have really unique strategies to be able to differentiate themselves from the others. That's a really nice strategy. But who exactly are we targeting? The market of coffee drinkers uh, includes virtually all adults and they're targeting those people who are on the go like students and working people and even those who drink coffee at home. Uh, the segment attractiveness includes uh, you know, money that people have to spend on drinking coffee, especially those who are working and uh, health conscious people who value organic beans. Ethical Beans offers Ethical Bean offers a broad spectrum of coffee flavors at the same time, so it offers a flavor for um, you know, all kinds of people. That's, that's, that's a really good point. But how exactly does Ethical Beans differentiate itself from Starbucks and other fair trade coffee shops? Yeah, so besides the health attra attractiveness and variety, they have a 14 year experience certified Q-Creator tester. And they also boast a unique roasting process and they strategically choose their coffee growers and also invest in those communities in developing countries. Oh wow. Let's move on to the marketing position. What exactly do you have for us? In terms of positioning, Ethical Beans is in the mid-level pricing and offers higher quality. Again, that's because of their whole organic uh, beans which don't use any pesticides and are uh, of great quality. They also give their customers a lot of uh, flexibility in terms of taking the coffee beans and making coffee on their own. Therefore, their brand concept is based on fairness and their brand image is perceived by their customers as uh, a, tra a transparent company that is innovative and has a lot of options. Oh, okay. I see. I really like this analysis of the strategy. I think you guys should just bring this to me tomorrow. I'll approve it and send it to Ethical Beans tomorrow morning. Good yeah, job, guys. Thank you. Thank you, ma'am.